Hey, this is Michelle Getzinger here, and I'm at Zephaniah 317 Project, which is a nonprofit here in New Kensington, and they're doing amazing things for the community. So Zephaniah 317 Project is really cool on multiple levels, and I'm gonna go ahead and introduce you to the founders and the board members here. Okay, my name is Hopeton Thompson. My name is Roy. My name is Jackie Hordick. And Hopeton, tell us a little bit about what this nonprofit does. Uh, this is an interesting nonprofit. It's a conceptual idea in that um, what we do is we really focus on the local community. We help individuals to get their lives back together. We work with other nonprofits in the area. I think St. Vincent de Paul is one of them and a few others. We like to focus on the, the, the more spiritual aspect or the, that part of it in that um, if, you are in, if you know somebody who needs help or is in need of stuff or is just transitioning from a bad situation and they need furniture or they need, um, what would you call them, um, appliances yep. and things of that nature, mm -hmm. um, you know, you go talk to your pastor, you let them know what's going on. Your pastor kind of says, okay, here, you know, here's a reference. You've been counseling and that kind of stuff. And it's at a greatly reduced cost or even free, depending on your situation. So we support the small local churches or even larger ones. Um, you come, you let us know, and we're more than happy to help you out. With that being said, if you're looking to get rid of some furniture, this nonprofit will come and they can pick it up and bring it over here, help you move it and um, they then in turn use it for donations. And they have another, um, another project that they work on too. If you have extra materials, you pack it in a container and you send it overseas to missionaries, correct? Yes, that's correct. Um, we um, also try to extend Zephaniah in other countries um, to do the same thing we're doing because initially um, we started with no money, so the board members are the people raising the funds. Every week we put ten dollars per person, um, and that money, you know, gets to a substantial, substantial amount. Uh, but nonetheless, we involve other countries because the other non-profits in the other countries, like Nigeria, Cameroon, um, Dominican Republic, they try to contact us, Uganda, to help them out. You know. Mm -hmm. um, Financially, we don't have the finance. Mm -hmm. So we empower them to do exactly the same thing we've been doing. Um, we started with nothing and we're raising money, just the board members. And that money is going a long way. Yeah, It's been a wonderful blessing and pleasure to be able to come alongside with the other members of Zephaniah. Um, not only do we provide the uh, household items and the material products that uh, our people would want, but we also provide them spiritual support. And it's a blessing to be able to encourage them to see how their lives change when they have an opportunity to make a step up for their own selves and to further on their, their homes and their lives and their families. So we're here a lot, as uh, Hopeton said, spiritually as well as uh, physically providing those needs. Okay, so some of the donations that they're looking for are larger household appliances, couches, tables, glassware, appliances they'll take. They'll also take clothing, but they'd like it to be in a separate bag and please no trash. So when you do give them a call, um, just we'll set up a time to come out and take a look at it so they know how many guys to pick it up. Donation wise, I mean, if you take a look around the store, you'll see all different um, assortments of uh, household furniture. We have couches, we have lawn chairs, we have whatever it is. The issue is we really can't take stuff that's unusable because that becomes a problem to us. Mm -hmm. And I mean, we're a nonprofit and we're the ones who are actually donating. We have no outside donors. And so we're paying for it. We can't afford a dumpster. So if it's stuff that's unusable, please, you know, help us out and, you know, understand that. On the second part of that is if you're staging a home or something like that and you want to use some of the furniture here, please come take a look. Uh, we're more than happy to help you out with that. And again, you know, we can take that stuff back and we can resell it and, or sell it, I should say, and utilize it in other ways. So it's a help, help. You know, you're helping us and we're helping you. And what a transformation the New Kensington is going through right now. And it all seems to be for the better. They've done a lot for the community and you guys are doing a lot for the community as well, which is great. So the location here is um, on the main street and uh, we're gonna put all the information down below in the link. And please come over and check out the store. And if you'd love to volunteer, we'd love to have you. Okay, and from all of us to all of you, 
Thank, Thank you. Thank you. God bless you. God bless you.